We need to shield the artifact they've got here right away. Using Garno's data, I should be able to accomplish this without difficulty. Damn thing's been here the whole time. Why weren't we affected? Perhaps the amount of time spent near the artifact is key. After a certain duration, it affords Leviathan an impressive mind control capability. I'd call it dangerous as hell. Bryson's assistant tried to kill me. Perhaps Leviathan was controlling him to protect itself, diverting people away from its trail. Maybe. It just shows we don't know what we're dealing with yet. Despite the risk, this artifact remains our only link to finding Leviathan. Perhaps we could find more information about it here in the lab. Agreed. Bryson's team might have turned up something we missed. I'll look around. Bryson's assistant, Hadley. Do we have an update on his status? He is in a vegetative state. The doctors believe it is permanent. But the miners recovered when the artifact was destroyed. Hadley lost consciousness when he attempted to answer our questions about Leviathan. It may have been a deliberate attempt to silence him permanently. They were testing the artifact for energy emissions. And found nothing. Still, I recommend leaving it shielded. Anything interesting about the artifact structure? It is not constructed of the same compounds used in standard Reaper technology. Beyond that, nothing of relevance. Edie, what project was Garno working on when he found the artifact? Basilisk. Got anything on Basilisk? Several ships, a mythical creature, and a rare mid-tier enemy type in the Galaxy of Fantasy video game. It possesses a gaze attack capable of triggering synced animation kills. Player forms describe it as overpowered. I meant the project, Edie. Oh. Then, no. There's gotta be something here on this artifact. What about the server? Bryson's assistant wiped the office server and destroyed all backups, likely before killing Bryson. However, records show new messages on Bryson's personal comm terminal upstairs. Could be worth a look. Loch Ness Monster? Plesiosaur. Loch Ness Monster is more interesting. Interesting and non-existent. A message from Dr. Bryson's daughter, Anne. According to my records, she worked with her father. I'm at the dig site in the Pylos Nebula. Project Scarab paid off. I've got another artifact like the one Garneau found. I think it could be affecting people's behavior. You need to shield the one in your office. I tried to warn Garneau, but I can't get through. We've got Reaper scouts coming in toward the main site. I'm heading to the secondary base to grab what research I can. Anne Bryson was attempting to contact Garno on the asteroid colony. She seems to know something about the artifact. She sounded worried. If Reaper forces were approaching, her concern was warranted. Let's hope we get to her before they do. She said she was in the Pylos Nebula, 
working for Project Scarab. That cluster contains several systems. I'll call up the nebula on the galaxy map. We may also search the lab for clues to narrow down her location. Can you identify this, Edie? It originates with a pre-spaceflight culture, but there are none recorded in the Pylos Nebula. The Reapers. Let's hope we find Anne before they do. Does anything in Anne Bryson's work history suggest where she might be? Nothing relevant. Any idea if Project Scarab involved Element Zero? Unlikely. We may learn more from the Project Requisitions Locker. Any correlation between Project Scarab and these unexplained creature sightings? Not beyond Leviathan itself. Anne Bryson flew out on a ship called the Icarus. Can you track its movements? No. The Reapers have disrupted civilian comm buoys, but we might learn more if we find the ship's specifications. There are specifications for several ships here. We need to find the Icarus. Which ship am I looking for again? The Icarus. The Icarus. Here we go. The ship has enhanced electrostatic discharge cells. They facilitate long-range FTL travel. So they jumped to the Pylos Nebula by mass relay, then flew to another system? Yes. Otherwise, they would have chartered a less expensive ship. Okay. We can rule out the relay system. The locker is secure. We must locate an access card to open it. What about criminal activity in the Pylos Nebula? Because the area is part of the Attica Traverse, criminal reports are unreliable at best. Access card for the requisitions locker? Yes. According to records, it was last used by Anne Bryson to obtain equipment for Project Scarab. Let's see what Anne Bryson requisitioned for Project Scarab. Didn't need an environmental suit. Didn't take breathing masks. Wind protection gear. Based on what Anne Bryson did or did not requisition, the dig site was arid but habitable. Get me a filter for systems with compatible planets. Based on the search data, it is one of these two systems. Based on the data, only one system remains a viable possibility. Good. Let's go get Anne Bryson.
confirmed. Evasion successful. I found something. We have located Anne Bryson's dig site. So we got reports of an attack on an excavation site. Right. Edie, can you tell us anything else? This is the main site of a series of excavations established under Dr. Garrett Bryson. Staff records confirm the project lead is his daughter, Anne. She has recently uncovered another artifact possibly linked to Leviathan. That discovery must have made this dig site a target. Yes. The attack means the Reapers are one step ahead of us. We need to pick up the pace. And since Bryson's daughter is our only lead, our objective is clear. Cortez? Nothing so far, Commander. If she's down there, she hasn't responded to our hails. Getting some strange signals, though. Give me a minute. The artifacts she uncovered may have caused problems. We know they're dangerous. Agreed. Take us in closer. Copy that. We have hostiles! Take us in. Commander, on the landing platform! That's her. Okay, let's get... Damn! Tracking multiple bogeys! Get us over there. Negative, it's too hot. Heading to lower platform. Hang on! There, go! Jump! Somewhere above us. Hello? Is anyone there? I'm coming down. No, stay where you are. This is Commander Shepard of the Alliance Navy. It's too dangerous. We'll come to you. Yes, okay. 
Can you find a place to hide? I'll try. Get there. Stay put. another path. Looks like a bridge over there. Controls are broken. Someone try to fix it. Yes, Commander. This crude wiring has failed. I'll need a moment. The bridge is operational. Raising it now. Understood. This way. Copy that. Arms in the hand. 
Stay hidden, Doctor. We're trying, but there's too many of them. Hurry! I will comply. As you wish. What's happening? Kirkwood and Boyles try to run for it. The Reapers got him. Don't move until we get there.
Elevator's online. We're coming up. Please hurry. I think Hopkins is dead. He tried to run. I told him not to, but he wanted to help the others. Where did everyone go? I'm sorry. They didn't make it. Doctor, I need you to come with me. Oh, God. Yes, of course. I uh, was at another dig site when they attacked. I got back as quick as I could, but what's happening? Shepard, look. I'm not sure, but it might have something to do with these paintings. Is that Leviathan? Y yes Yes, we think so. It's, it's old, much older than my father thought. And there, as if the natives were under its power. Clearly a reaper, but acting alone. Not like any reaper we've seen before. Doctor, I understand you found something recently. The artifact. Yes, of course. Incredible. It's just ahead. It may sound strange, but I'm certain it affects people, their behavior. I've only had a short time to study it. Not strange at all. Did you find anything? Not much, but I did learn something about the energy it generates. Get down! What are they doing? They've activated it. I've never managed anything... Doctor? They've learned to uh, The darkness must not be breached. Commander! Take it out! Got it. You okay? Cortez, we have Ann Bryson. Need a pickup. On my way, Commander. Copy that. You see the shuttle, you run. Don't look back. Okay. Yes. Yeah, Commander. I, I think so. I blacked out. Leviathan took control of her. We cut the connection before you got hurt. Leviathan itself? That's incredible. The Reapers seem as interested in it as we are. Yeah. 
It certainly seems that way. We were hoping you could help us figure out why. But first, Doctor, I have some bad news. Anne, please. Suppose Leviathan's broken away from the other Reapers, never went back to dark space, like a rogue or even a defector. I have to call my father. He'll want to know. Anne, you need to listen to me, okay? Your father is dead. I'm sorry. He's... what? Dead? He can't be dead. We met with him, hoping to find out what he knew. Something happened. Something happened? And you're not the first to lose control. Your father's assistant. One minute he was fine, the next... drew a gun on your father. I couldn't stop him. I can't believe this. We have to find out what's behind it all. You're the only one who can help us. And? I... I, I want to see his office. We'll arrange for transportation. Meet you there. Commander? Commander? I have formulated a psych profile for Dr. Anne Bryson. She is not used to death, but she may be quite capable under stress. How's the ship holding up, Edie? The envelope of mass-free space we create when we travel at FTL limits any impact of micro-collisions with ambient dust. Nevertheless, some ablation does occur at subluminal speeds. Normandy will need maintenance before the year is out. If we live that long, I will totally spring for it. I heard you had to break the news to Anne about her dad. I'm sorry, Shepard. So brutal what happened to him. Can't imagine what she's going through. Hey there. A pleasure to see you. What is it with you and rescuing scientists from dig sites that have been overrun by hostile forces? If you decide to help her take down the Shadow Broker, I'm going to be jealous and somewhat concerned. Thanks for coming by. I can handle the Reapers that run around or the ones that crawl, or the ones that shuffle menacingly toward you, but it's the flying ones that give me the creeps. Not right now. Leviathan is a defector, a reaper that broke away from the others. Then it is also a traitor, and traitors are never to be trusted, even among the enemy. If they can betray their own kind, imagine what they can do to you. Commander. on a human ship? Hey, the Normandy's design was part Turian, remember? You know what I mean. No, 
somebody has to keep you from giving all the dextrose a bad name. That's right. I remember you chastising me on behalf of my species for losing our homeworld to the Geth. I never said that. Would you like me to send you an audio recording? Uh, no, I hate listening to recordings of myself. My voice never comes out right. Hmm. Listen, about what I said. Forget it. No, I was wrong. I was young and... I was wrong about your people. Oh. And about you. Oh. Thanks. How about you? You ever mind serving on an all-human ship? It's not all human. As long as you're here. I'm glad and Bryson got out safely. I just hope we find Leviathan before the Reapers do. Talk to you later. Commander. Another harvester keeps me from dropping you off on the target LZ, so help me. That's the bond. Don't let those oversized roaches push you around. Mr. Vega, taking on a sky full of worm necks and a troop transport is like sending you against the Earth invasion armed with brass knuckles. What? You don't think I could do it? Doesn't hurt to go over the weapon roster one more time. I don't know the scientific measurement of a shitload, but that seemed like a shitload of harvesters. Hey, 